Hello everyone out there in YouTube land. I am back with another video and I'm looking a little messy today because I'm multitasking. I am cleaning the apartment and waiting for the floor to dry in the kitchen. So I'm gonna go through some empties for you because they've been piling up. Piling! Yes, the screen. This should be my thumbnail, but it'll never come out that way. Anyway, so I have a whole bunch of empties that I'm gonna share with you. I can't even tell you how many months worth of empties this is. I'm going to put my hair up because it's getting in my face. Okay. All right. So let's go through the empties. So first we have Bath and Body Works Energy Orange Ginger Body Wash and Foam Bath. I just finished using this. It was okay. It doesn't really smell like orange and ginger. It kind of does. It doesn't. It's not strongly scented, which I guess is good because I'm not a big orange ginger person. But as far as it giving you energy, like I've used this at night and it didn't make me feel any more energetic. So I don't know about, you know, how the how truthful the aromatherapy aspect of this is. And then I have from the Dollar Tree, silk it, silk essence. Uh, new advanced pro formula two-in-one shampoo and conditioner this was okay I prefer the conditioner by itself conditioner by itself is really good um, and then we have a tea gel shampoo uh, for psoriasis which I have this is always a repeat purchase for me this sucked I put this in on Dollar Tree this is the Alberto vo5 dry scalp I try to get away with getting a cheaper product rather than the tea gel because that's more expensive it's like a little bottle like that is like ten dollars and this was a dollar but it really does not work so that was the end of that was that actually was this shampoo and conditioner no just nourishing shampoo for dry scalp does not work this is from the dollar tree this is a repeat buy for me i really like this it just it's got a very girly scent to it. it kind of reminds me of debbie gibson electric youth you guys remember that like, if I could remember what that smelled like, because it was so many years ago, then I would imagine that it smelled like this. Um, so this is Power Stick Scream, spelled S-C-R-E-E-M, a body spray for her. So that was really good. I've bought that a few times. This, Bath and Body Works, Hair and Body, Botanical Blend. It's all right. It's very, it's very manly scented, very barbershop. Oh, it reminds me of like if you were watching washing yourself with the Barbasol uh, shaving cream and shaving cream it smells just like that so I, I don't think I'd get that again this was pretty good um, the lavender and sandalwood from Bath and Body Works this is the uh, natural lavender oil body wash with olive oil yeah this was really really nice I would definitely get this again this smells really pretty it's got a lavender oatmeal scent to it it's very very nice Next one is the Coco Shea Cucumber. It was all right. It smells like a fresh sliced cucumber. It says, um, really refreshing foaming scrub. I guess so. Um, I'm just not a fan of the texture of this. It's kind of slimy. So I don't know if that would be a repeat buy for me. If you keep me, if, if you keep me, if you keep seeing me go like this, and this is because... I'm nearsighted, which means I can't see far away, but I used to be able to see close up with my glasses on, even though I'm nearsighted. Now I have to pull them down. I need bifocals because as soon as I try to look at something close up, it goes out of focus and I can't see. Okay, so this one, uh, the essential oils, Bath and Body Works, almond and vanilla. Um, this one smells really good too. I have to say I really did like these. I like the texture. I like the scent. It's not overwhelming. It feels very comforting, very uh, creamy, very moisturizing, you know. So that was a good purchase. Um, this is a repeat purchase for me. If Ladies, if you're looking for shave gel for a dollar, this is it. Get this at the Dollar Tree. It's men's, but it's the shave gel in the orange container. And it says for, it says ultra rich sensitive really really good so then I have the true blue true blue spa shea butter silky smooth shave cream this was really good as well but more money it just has a, a very like a clean I don't know how to say it just smells like plain unscented moisturizer so what I get this again 
yes, it's a good product. If it's cheap enough, I will get it again. Uh, and then we have another can of that um, Scream stuff from Dollar Tree that was really good. Another reason I'm going through my empties is because for the first time in like months and months and months, I saw a giant bug in my apartment that always freaks me out. But it's always after it rains and my mother always says, oh, it's just a water bug, but it's, it's still a bug. So and I have Shades of Summer, Summer Suntan. Is this the one that smells like copper tone? Yeah, this is the one that smells like copper tone. So I would definitely repurchase this. I love that suntan scent. This was good. Um, this is the Bath and Body Works soap, the fancy soap. This is the Jasmine and Tiger Lily hand soap, purely clean. This was good. It wasn't slimy. I like the texture of it. I would get it again. I think it is very good for cleaning. Got another one of these shave gels. This I picked up in... Um, where the hell did I buy this? In the Dollar Tree. It's Honey Vanilla. Honey Vanilla, the essence of nature, hand wash. Um, it's, it smells like a baby's butt. It smells like um, wet wipes. So, yeah. This I bought in Dollar Tree. It was all right. Um, deep Moisture Shampoo. This is Shea Solutions organic shea butter this was in the uh i don't want to say, what do i say the ethnic aisle the specialty aisle for people with coarser hair so i figured i'd try it, it was all right i got some uh good housekeeping soaps from um telco that i bought for a dollar so this was passion pineapple these are all good i continue to use them i continue to pick them up for a dollar yeah, it smells like pineapples. I mean, they're they're pretty well scented. Um, they're not slimy, although if you can see, there's still some left in there. It is kind of slimy. Like you, um, but on your hands it feels good. And look, I got another one, so I must have liked it. Then I have the uh, coconut mint drop. This was the body lotion. This was all right. I was not nuts about this. I wouldn't I wouldn't repurchase it. I know people love this, but eh, not for me. Then I have the LA Looks Extreme Sport. Get this in the Dollar Tree. Good stuff. And I always tell people, instead of getting the giant um, gel, get the smaller one because eventually it's going to clog up on you and you're going to feel like you need a new one. So just buy them in the smaller ones and get fresh. Right? Um, this is Sparkling Mint Blossom. I don't remember what this smells like. Some of these are so old, I don't remember what they smell like. This smells really nice. It smells like a candy perfumey mint. So, yeah. And packaging is cute with a little deer on it. Uh, gardenia and spring rain. You know, I'm a big floral person. Like I said, I don't remember what this smells like. Uh, it's okay. It's a little too, too grandma flowery for me. Uh, I don't know if I'd get that again. Then I have the uh, coconut mint drop in the shower gel. Let me see if it smells different. No, it's it smells better in the shower gel than it does in the body lotion. I don't know why. Maybe I would get the shower gel again. It just it really smells more of uh, coconut than mint. I'm trying to get through all of these because there's a whole bunch. Lakeside afternoon. I think I like this one. You know I like fresh scents. Yeah, but it's pretty generic. It smells like you know black tie or any of those like cologne uh, aqua kind of scented stuff. Cocktail dress. Don't remember what this smells like at all. It's 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 like generic BBW perfume smell. But the packaging is nice. Then I have the uh, Be Merry uh, Nourishing Soap with Hand Butter uh, Gingerbread Latte. I believe I like this a lot. It has like an eggnoggy smell. Yeah, it has like a creamy eggnog smell. This one was really good, but... I don't know if I would repurchase this in bulk because that eggnog smell kind of has like a, a sour milk kind of scent to it. How much stuff do I have here? Okay. Frosted Winter Woods. I've been wanting to try that for a while. It smells like Christmas trees. I would get it again. I'm a fan of the, uh, you know, the fresh outdoorsy scents. Oahu Coconut. Sunset. I wouldn't get this again. I'm staying away from the, um, I mean, it's a good scent, 
This is a crushed coconut body scrub. It's a little too abrasive for me. I think I'm going to stay away from the scrubs. I don't need them that much. I do sometimes feel like I need like some exfoliating, but not all the time. It's just too heavy for me. Um, French tulips. Are you guys getting bored? I feel like I'm getting bored rattling off these names this was really nice french tulips is really nice it's a pretty light floral it smells like that amsterdam al almonds amsterdam windmills and something it smells like that candle this is uh oil-free acne wash that i got at dollar tree this made no difference i, I would not repurchase frosted cranberry i love the candle so this <coughs> oh that smells like it went a little bad it must have been in there a while it's it's it smells like cranberry like a uh, cranberry sauce again this uh true blue spa silky smooth shave cream good stuff but pricey even though i got it at the bath and body works sale this thousand wishes on uh, this is such a sin though i'm throwing out a whole bottle of um of lotion because it went bad I think it went bad and it just smells sour so yeah one of my favorite soaps bought it tons of it yes girl this one smells really really nice to give it as gifts I just love it I don't know what about it that I love so much but it's just amazing I can't even describe it to you it's white jasmine white jasmine and sparkling nectarine um yeah oil of oil of olay gentle clean not nuts about it would not repurchase this is one of my favorites i don't know how they didn't get sued on the name this is a shea butter this is purple rain it smells like grapes yep yeah, smells like grapes so if you want to smell like a, a candy grape this is good stuff <coughs> okay and this is a repurchase for me you know how they have the after after you go to the restroom sprays, you know, or like before you go to the restroom spray and then after restroom spray. Anyway, you know what I'm talking about without me getting detailed and icky. So this is glitter and go cotton candy spray. I actually really like this. Although, you know, you, when you leave the bathroom, the next person that goes in, it smells like a county fair, like popcorn and cotton candy and stuff, but it works really well. And it, it works even well as like a regular air freshener or even like a little body spritz. So there's that. I think that's everything. I don't know what I have. I have an extra bag in here with, I don't even know what's in it. What the hell is this? Oh, I found one of my sweaters. Okay. Um, yeah, so that's it. I'm glad I got all that out of the way and hopefully uh, I won't see any more of those, those bugs. Um, yeah, so I'm going to get back to cleaning my floor, but until next time, goodbye everyone out there in YouTube land.